In water management systems, the integration of a motor with a float switch ensures efficient control over water levels, preventing both low and high level extremes. This setup is crucial in maintaining optimal water levels in tanks, wells, or reservoirs. Components Motor The pump or motor is responsible for water circulation. Float switch A device that activates or deactivates the motor based on water levels. Control circuit Manages the interaction between the motor and float switch. Low water level, first action. When water levels drop to a predetermined low, the float switch triggers the control circuit. The control circuit activates the motor, ensuring water is pumped into the tank. This prevents the motor from running dry and safeguards the pump. Control circuit action. The control circuit monitors the status of the float switch. If the float switch indicates a low water level, it commands the motor to start. As the motor runs, water is drawn into the system, raising the float switch. High water level, second action. As water levels rise, the float switch reaches a predetermined high level. The control circuit responds by deactivating the motor to prevent overflows. This action maintains the water level within the desired range. Operation Maintenance and Testing Regularly inspect the float switch for proper functionality. Test the entire system periodically to ensure the motor responds accurately to water levels. Applications Widely used in agricultural irrigation systems, water tanks, and sewage systems. Provides a reliable and automated solution for maintaining water levels.